Welcome Gemini's. This is the um, Pisces season, um, the season run from um, the um, 19th of February until the 20th of March. I want to say to you guys, um, thank you for returning. Please remember, um, if this is your first time, like, share and subscribe, thumbs up and let's get in the reading. All right, so it is, um, remember that all seasons have four symbols, okay? It doesn't really matter if you're looking for the number on the dice, you just look for the reading for the dice, okay? Um, these four elements or symbols uh, signified, um, you know, what direction, what is advice for you as a person, okay? So we all have four elements. We vibrate on the four elements, uh, fire, water, and hair, and earth. So what transpires is that uh, whenever you use the symbol, it depends on your moon, rise, and sign, um, you will accumulate uh, enough information to help you move forward. So it's beautiful, it's beautiful, it's beautiful. Let's look at your numbers. We have the sun, which is uh, the most powerful thing, Gemini's. And um, I see that a lot of Gemini's, I did this, uh, um, this reading, and a lot of Gemini's in the Pisces season are going to be getting some sort of a luck and push. And the situation is why you're going to be getting luck and push is because uh, um, you and the Pisces vibrate on the same number energy, okay? So we need to recognize that number have significant roles in our life. A whole lot of us is not aware of that. But as you are aware, you recognize that numbers create significant role in our lives, in business and um, in work, okay? So what we're recognizing here is that you have the energy of the sun. It's upright. And it is only going to be a successful period from February 19 until um, March 20th. So that is when the Pisces season is over. And what we're now recognizing is that uh, you, Pisces, you, um, uh, Gemini's, is going to be so ecstatic. You're going to be so surprised. You're going to be recognizing. Um, what is happening around you? You're going to be recognizing how oh, the spicy season is really exhilarating you and pushing you in the correct direction. And this is going to be absolutely fabulous. So um, we start off with the energy of the sun. The energy of the sun is always 19 and 19. 1 and 9 is 10. Okay, 10 breakdown, it's one. Okay, so a lot of you Geminis are going to be having three um, shift. You're going to be working on the shift of 19. You're going to be working on the shift of 10. Some of you are going to be having new beginnings. Some of you, Omega is going to be helping you to release you from a, um, a male supervisor or a boss that is very deceptive. A judgment call is going to be coming down on this person. Um... So you can see the judgment come down on the Aries Leo or Fireside Man. They recognize what this man have done. So um, you have, uh, so we, we, we go to one, six, which is seven, um, and two is nine. Okay, so um, an end is coming up. So some of you who were dealing with a, a Fireside a person, a boss, a business person, someone who was, uh, um, you know, accessing, your life and creating a whole lot of issues. I see a judgment call is coming down on this person. They're now recognizing who this person is and what this person have done and created. And I see that a whole lot of you are going to be happily knowing that finally a Aries Day or a fire sign man is going to be fired or be re removed from their position. And this is going to be good. So huge success in the week of... Uh, um, February 19 until 28th, huge success. There's no question. Um, there is absolutely no question about this huge success is going to be coming up because they're going to be recognizing that you Gemini's have not been given and pushed in the right direction. A lot of you have not been, um, getting the right, uh, uh promotion, the right, uh, um, 
recognition and I see that they're going to be recognizing this and it's going to be helping you Gemini's to burst out of what was um, um, and blocking you and keeping you back. Um, you know, you're going to be taking the honor roll. So, you know, Gemini's from the 19th of February until um, the 28th of February, you need to use up this hair sign, this air energy and frequency that is coming in because it's going to be powerful the last week that is actually the last week of uh, um the month of february and you're coming out of an air sign energy and that's why your weeks are so powerful between the 19 and the 28 is because you recognize uh, that uh, your sister sign the aquarians are there that is going to be giving you um gemini's huge huge success So, Geminis accept, uh, accept some sort of a help from Aquarians because they are going to be recognizing and helping you Gemini out in order to be very successful over some sort of a uh, problem and situation that will occur um, with your money and your prosperity, okay? So, that is really, really powerful. Then we're moving forward and we are looking at the second week. The second week is from the 1st of March until the 7th of March. So write these sweets date down. Um, one of the sweetest date and your best week is going to be the 19th until the 28th. Also, the energy of, so you have two weeks behind each other that is just going to be powerful and you got to use this energy because you you're now in the the second week beginning in the energy of water emotions but it's going to be very very positive okay you can see there the energy of pleasure so you're going to be feeling really happy going to work on the work floor things are going to be flowing um you know things that was uh, out of control is going to be rebalanced you are feeling yourself you're not so tired you have your rest that uh, you're learning to balance uh, um, your career and work life and this is good a lot of stuff that was old up and was backed up at work is now being resolved and it is running smooth at the workplace you are happy everyone is happy and i see this is going to be a really really positive uh, positive uh, um two weeks so where we look at uh, the week of the 19th of february until the 7th of Feb uh, of march so, you know, it is positive and it's really, really a, a, a time of competitive, but it, you don't have to compete. This is what it is saying. You don't have to compete. You have it. You have the expertise and the knowledge. You really, really don't have to compete because, uh, um, you know, even that it is, it took some of you um, a long time to be recognized for your work. You're finally now going to be recognized. Okay. So that is powerful um, for you, Gemini. So, um, you're going in emotion and it's going to be a positive emotion, not to worry. Um, you know, the res resolution of uh, problems is going to be good. This week is going to be running smooth. All right. Let's look at uh, the third week. The third week is from the 8th until the 14th. Now, what is happening, Gemini, is that uh, you're going to be bringing down judgment on some a group of people you're going to be recognizing what a group of people have done you're going to be speaking up about a group of people because you recognize so um that you know there was uh, um you know uh, people um in either your department or in your company or um you know on the work floor that was creating a whole lot of issue and i see you gemini's are going to be bringing them back up in balance you gemini's are going to be saying listen um I, I i need some sort of a teamwork so i see a lot of you gemini are going to be reprimanding people okay you are the one that is going to be blowing the trumpet you're going to be reprimanding people and letting people know how far to go and what you expect so this is going to be good so whatever that was happening and transpiring and whoever that was trying to create some sort of a problem 
in the work atmosphere. I see you, Gemini's are really standing your ground and say, no, no, no. Um, you know, it's either you get with a program or you find another job. And I see you, Gemini's are really, really going to be giving it to people in this week. So, you know, if I, I work with you, Gemini's, I would stay out of your way and make sure that my work is properly done because you, Gemini's are really, really going to be having it out with people and it's going to let people know, hey, we need to make some sort of a changes and these changes need to, um, um, you know, happen in a way where you are recognizing we need to make these changes in a very positive way in order for us to be um, recognizing what we need to do, how we need to do it, is the process running and that things are going and so you see this month is is coming up as some sort of an unexpected um uh situation where you some of you gemini's is going to be really, really stepping in and said listen people we got to shake up we got to make some changes we got to shake up things a little bit okay so this is going to be good and um as you do that you're going to be really shaking up people, really shaking up things and really letting people recognize uh, um, that, um, you know, it, it's, it's do or die. It is a time of do or die. There are other people that would like to have your position. So it is a time of do or die. So, you know, make make the choice because at uh, um, you're going to be recognizing that some sort of a choice this needs to be made and people need to recognize and understand um, that they have to shake up or uh, it's a make or break situation in this week from the 8th until the 14th. As we look at the week from the 15th until the 20th, um, a lot of you uh, make some sort of a decision in the third week that is going to be affecting an Aries Leo or Sagittarius in the last week um, so remember, these are not monthly readings. These are season reading. It goes with the season of the zodiac and it's a water energy. You're dealing with this um, fireman and you're going to be letting this man know, hey, uh, I don't see a future for you here. Okay. Whatever is happening in transpiring, you're not really seeing a future for this person here. Because you're now recognizing that this man um, have created a whole lot of issues, um, you know, in your department, um, in the management meeting, um, you know, created a whole lot of problems. And, uh, you know, whatever the issues, whatever the situation, whatever the problems is and was, people are going to be recognizing um, that this man has not been very honest. This man has not been very honest because people are now recognizing who this person is and how these person have adjust and created some sort of an issue and problem. And now truth is really coming out. So, you know, the, the, the most horrible thing about um, what is going to be transpiring is that you, um, you know, Gemini's are going to be saying, yeah, it, it, you know, to hear and no further because... Um, you know, this is not working. This is basically not working. And I have been trying to bring back some sort of a balance and stability in order to resolve some sort of an issue. But um, you seem to be throwing people, things and situation um, out and you got to recognize, hey, um, you need to back up and recognize where we are, what we're doing and uh, that this is a teamwork. And if you can't teamwork, then I would you know, advise you to look for a job somewhere else. So I see really that people are really recognizing and seeing what is happening and transpiring. And you Gemini's are like, uh, um, I got to let this person know before it goes too far. I got to let this person go because it's not working out. I got to make changes um, because I recognize uh, that whoever this person is, is not um working out to, with us and i gotta let this person find another job and give them enough time so i see even that you're bringing down this judgment call gemini's you are also letting this person know hey i have tried we have tried 
it's not working. So it's better for us to just recognize, hey, um, you know, we got to move on. We got to let it go and we got to move on. However way it is going to be coming up and transpiring, that is the best situation for both of us at this time. So and this is going to be working out in your favor, Gemini. So um, use this um, Pisces season in order to do this so that you don't move forward with this person that is creating obstacles and issues in your world. You got to recognize that it is time for you to recognize um, that when a, a person um, is not uh, com uh, competitive and when a person is too competitive or when a person is just creating chaos in your world, you got to... Um, move them out of your atmosphere and out of your energy and this is what someone was doing at the workplace okay so gemini i see a lot of changes coming up in you gemini's especially managers and that is good now in order to see and choose one of these symbol you gather use um the link and join use the blue button and show your loves, thumbs up, like, share these video. It's going to be powerful for this Pisces season for you, Gemini's. I gotta go. Namaste.